Star Trek day to you. Hey, how y'all doing? This here is Zeke Pat with the weekly installment of the Hillbilly DVD review. And this week I will be reviewing the Star Trek motion picture come out 2009, I do believe. Hour and 26 minutes, or also known as uh, 126 minutes, and it's rated PG 13. <laughs> hey, how y'all doing? Hey! Done here by J.J. Abrams. He done lots of good stuff. Uh, it, they say here is fun, smart, sexy, sleek, and action-packed. And uh, Star Trek is a burst of pure filmmaking exhilaration. Uh, it's not just a great Star Trek movie. It's a great movie, period. Hi, uh, hi. I mean, when, the, when the movie starts off with, uh, uh, who was it there? The Beastie Boys uh, sabotage. And, you know, and, the, and the, little, the little boy there, what his name? Uh... Oh, what's that little actor's name? Hey, how you... D and he rides that motorcycle thing, but it's up in the air, like, you know, Star Trek capabilities, because that's where they live, and that's the, that's the parts. And that was James T. Kirk when he was just a young, just a young boy. This is Zeke Patton here, interviewing myself. <laughs> what happens in the movie is some bad shit goes down, and, and, and they have to... Go somewhere far, far away, and 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 the young kid Spock, that arrogant little prick, whatever his name is, he has to go see old Spock. Leonard Nimoy is in this, and uh, he uh, he gives him some good advice and stuff, and and uh, so they come back, and 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 there's there's some actually some good looking uh, aliens kind of girls in it, you know, like Star Trek always, James T. Kirk always got the good pussy. And then he, you know, he gets invited to come aboard the Enterprise or whatever the hell it was where they was training. And he went there and that's when he met all them, Spock and them, and Scotty, I suppose. Uh, and, uh, hmm. E, 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 e. It was just an enjoyable experience. Man, I'll tell you, I've never been much of a Star Trek fan. Never got into the TV show. I believe I did see Wrath of Khan when I was, hmm. I was in sixth grade, I must have been, but I ain't never been no Star Trek fan, and I sure did like this movie, I walked out, I was happy, and I tell you what, I'm gonna go see Star Trek Part 2, J.J. does, fine movie, fine acting, beautiful women, exciting story, great, great, it's just intense, it's, it's the epitome, it's what a Star Trek movie now should be. On a scale of 1 to 10, if I was to rate this movie all in all, I would, I tell you right now, I rate this movie. I give it a 9. I give this here Star Trek a 9. A picture, beautiful picture, cinematography, nice. I'm going to get at y'all next week. Love you. Keep it real. Peace. And uh, and good movie going to you. All right. How y'all doing? This here is Zeke Pat with the weekly installment of DVD Hillbilly Review, also known as the Hillbilly DVD Review. How y'all... <laughs>